Hey there YouTube land, uh, today I'm at the uh, Green Footbridge in Cambridge. Um, they installed this uh, pretty recently, although um, I'm going to tell you a little bit about its story. So this Green Footbridge was first built, I believe in the 1890s, and the reason is because as you can see, this uh, stream runs under it. Now this is the Owl Kill River. And it goes, reaches from Lake Lauderdale all the way down to the Hoosick River. And as you can see, there's houses across the street. Now, the building behind me used to be a factory. So, basically, a lot of the employees lived across the brook or the river, or the creek, or whatever you want to call it. And they, up to that point, they had no way of getting across the brook very easily or conveniently. So what the owner of the factory decided to do was build this the green footbridge. That way the workers could get across the creek to get to work. Well, a number of years ago, they took the bridge down. I don't remember the exact reasons why it had to be taken down, but what they decided to do was they took the bridge down and they uh, restored it. But then uh, the pandemic put a halt to, I guess, rededicating it. But back in the, uh, I think in October, they rededicated the bridge and they reinstalled it, and now it, it is here as you see it today. It's a very nice bridge. Uh, there's some benches here you could sit on, though I wouldn't recommend sitting on this one because it's, oh, there's a stick underneath me because it's got a puddle on it. Um, you know, you can look down in the creek, you can, uh, you know, get some cool shots of everything. And, uh, you know, it's kind of a cool little place, and it makes getting across this creek a lot easier. So it's still serving its purpose to this day, even though that's not a factory anymore. It's kind of a YMCA public-type building. There's like a gym in it and a laundromat and some other things. Um, we call it the Victorian building. And where I'm standing right now is what we call Varick Park. So, yeah. So there's a little bit of a little piece of uh, Cambridge history of my hometown. Uh, anyway, thank you for watching, and if you haven't already, please like, comment, and subscribe.